is it moving no right when i switch on a torch to this one right if i switch on a torch to this right uh, will it move right now is the torch and will it move no right why because this light right this light has no ability of doing some work those are just waves right but what happens if i blow air right if i blow air what's happening if i blow air what will happen it moves why because the air particles go and collide with this right air particles go and collide with this one okay so ability to do some work is a particle property right ability to do some work is a particle property okay so that is called momentum ability to do some work so what we are going to do we take a cathode ray view like this and we place the cathode here Right. On this way, we place a paddle wheel. Right. We place a small paddle wheel like this. Right. Small paddle wheel like this. What is a paddle wheel? A small light wheel. Right. Then what happens? When cathode ray is generated and the cathode ray collides with this wheel, it rotates and comes to this end. Right? It rotates and comes to this end. Okay? Then, with the help of a switch, you can convert an open cathode. Right? Now the value wheel is on this side. When you change this one to the cathode, the cathode ray shall come from this side. The value wheel rotates and moves to the other side. Right. Likewise, the paddle wheel can be moved. Right. This is the cathode ray tube. Right. This is the cathode ray tube. Can you see inside there is a paddle wheel? It rotates and goes to the other side. Right. Uh, that is called the paddle wheel. Very light. Okay. This is a very light wheel that we have. Okay. It's a very light wheel that we have. Right? So we can change the anode and cathode by changing the wires, of course, right? So that this paddle wheel rotates and moves to either side, right? You can observe that. Okay, you can observe that during the practice, right? So it shows that they have a momentum, right? That shows that they have a momentum.